Hi and welcome to Regal Solutions Limited. In this video, I will explain how to pressurize a Valiant Ecotec Plus boiler. Low pressure, there is no heating, no hot water. That's flashing low pressure, 0.7. Okay. The pressure normally has to be between one and one half bar maximum. It shouldn't be more than one half bar. I'll show you how to pressurize, uh, pressurize the system. This is an Ecotec Plus boiler, Valent, which has got a built-in fillet loop underneath the boiler. There are two grey knobs underneath the boiler here. Yeah. This is the water inlet and this is the system pipe. So we turn off the first one, the hot water one, I mean the cold water one. The cold feed. Okay, okay we press this on the bar. Yeah, 1.2. 1.3, 1.4, and 1.5. We shut down the first one, and then we can shut down the second one. If you don't shut this one, you won't have any hot water coming out of your pipe. Yeah? So if you don't see any water, that means you didn't shut this. No. So you put it back on the place, and you can have the hot water now. Yeah? The boiler is showing 1.4, 1.5, 1 1.4 is fine. This is working now, so... <coughs> The pump is running, no problem. Okay, we go back to normal. This is how to pressurize a island boiler. Very easy and straightforward. Should you go, in case if you pressurize the boiler, and let's say it goes to 1.7, you shut down the both knobs, yeah? And then you can release the pressure from any radiator. You can just take the axis pressure and then just keep it stable on 1.5 bars. To select the temperature for hot water, this is the hot water you press at once. It shows 61. If you want to increase it, you press the plus, decrease, press minus, OK, saved. You can go back. Central heating, same thing. Central heating, plus and minus. Okay, and we go back. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to our channel. All details are on the screen now. If you have any question, please feel free to comment down below. Thank you.